Dog and Sun and Vancouver Island Raiders here at the Apple Bowl tonight. Ryan Waters, Jason Casey will have the play-by-play -play at 7 o'clock on AM 1150. Uh, Jason, it's the Raiders, it's the Sun. That rivalry is renewed again, and you know all about this rivalry, don't you? Oh, absolutely, yeah. To see these two guys come into the tilt, especially at home for the Sun, is going to be a benefit to them. Um, but, yeah, it's they're coming off a good win against the Rebels, and they want to keep that momentum. The Okanagan yeah. Sun need to prove that they can play four solid quarters, not kind of sporadic football. They need to start getting into that rhythm. Even though it's only week four out of ten weeks, they still need to show that, okay, we can put 60 minutes together on all three sides of the ball and command football games. There seemed to be a bit of a letdown in that fourth quarter. They allowed the Rebels to get that touchdown to bring it within six. Concerning your former head coach, would that concern you? I don't know if concern needs to be the word that used. Um, it needs to be addressed for sure. It needs yeah. to say, look, this is what could happen later down in the season, especially come playoff time. Um, so we need to put 60 minutes together. Offense, don't uh, take your foot off the, the throttle. When you have a team on the ropes and their defense is gassed, you need to go th for the jugular, which I don't think they did in the, towards the end of the third and into the fourth quarter. And then defensive-wise, do what you do best. You're fast and you're mean. Bring it to the team right until that last whistle. You got to keep bringing it to those teams to not give that your opponent a false sense of hey, we can claw back into the game, and you don't want your opponents to think that they can. Yeah, yeah. I talked to Coach McCauley a couple of times this week about the emotional letdown. We talked about it all broadcast long last week that it's such an emotional game with so many different factors in that game last week. Will this be an emotional letdown? What do you think? It possibly could because um, you know, let's be honest, the Raiders aren't the Raiders of old. They mm -hmm. just aren't. They don't have quite the the, the balanced firepower offensively that they have in previous years you know from you know 05 until about 2011 uh, where they just absolutely dominated the yeah. conference and the country let's be honest so it could be that but the caveat to that is you don't want to fall into that and just come out and get a mediocre win if you're the Okanagan Sun certainly you want to get an upset if you're the Raiders it would definitely be an upset if they come in here and beat the Sun um, but the Sun don't want to play down to their level they want to play substantially higher than where the Raiders are right now and to get that separation that hey we're the top dogs mm -hmm. you guys are going to come in and we're going to own you on our home field it will be another important game for the sun here tonight they're three and oh the raiders come in here two and one we'll have the play-by-play -play for you at seven o'clock on am 1150.